much for another video. Uh, today's video is Straw Box. Which we're going to open now. We hope you're all indoors watching this. Not outside, you should be indoors, naughty people. Yeah, when this came through the door, it, it was, was already broken. open. Yeah. You are allowed out to go to work, obviously. Well, let's use the actual opening area. I bet there's something missing in there. Yeah, what's something we're missing? What's something fell out? Silly postman. I'm sure he didn't open it. He's risking his life for the coronavirus oh, delivering cool. your letters. <gasps> oh, it's got a skeleton. A skeleton. 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 <gasps> oh, I like that. I think Barnaby would like that. I think Barnaby would like that. Hatch. Features artist. Features artist Hatch is a moniker of London-based artist and illustrator Dave, Dave Smith. Mixing bold lines with detailed patterns and tones, he creates graphic eye-catching compositions. I think Barnaby would like this. Here we go. This is this month's artist. Oh, yeah. Uh, you, can, you can follow him at Hatch underscore art or Twitter at Hatch underscore art. Facebook, Hatch Art and Illustrations and website www.hatchart.com Oh, oh, look how cute it is. Look at the cute little sticker. Oh, it's got a stick. Oh, it's got a little man on it. Okay, here's your... Hello. There we go. All right. There's my what's in my jiggy. So, what does the inside of your mind look like? If you had to draw your imagination, what sort of place would this be? Dimpto Chewy Bar. This month we want you to explore your strange and wonderful mind and then try and create a visual representation of your own imagination, closely examining the creatures, objects and places that might exist within it. Have some fun and get creative with the things you might include. It could be anything at all. Your imagination is a limit, quite literally. Nothing has to make sense, especially to anyone else other than yourself. You can include things you like, things you hate, places you've been or would like to go and any mystical creatures or objects you might find in a place like this. Let your imagination run wild and we know your creation will be an exciting and interesting marvel to behold. Oh. Okay, so the first thing I have is a pencil. It's a pencil. It is a Lyra Rembrandt Brandt art design pencil encased in cedar wood with ultra fine extra resistant graphite lead which makes them extremely durable to excessive use. This premium pencil is the ideal instrument for all your drawing, sketching and designing needs and its high durability makes it perfect for constant demand of any artist. That is one pound and twenty penny winkles. The next thing I have is a ruba. A ruba. A Faber-Castell dust-free eraser. A uh, perfect tool for removing any lead, charcoal or colour pen colouring pencil markings. The eraser is designed to create minimal eraser shavings and the shavings it does create stick together for easy disposal, leaving you to concentrate on your artwork without worrying about making multiple trips to the dustbin. £1.55. Yeah, you cool put several rub rubbers out in. Rubbers out in? You put several rubber out in bits in the dustbin. I just I didn't, on the uh, yeah, same. <laughs> this looks kind of see through ish. Just like. It looks funny. It does look funny. It doesn't look like a normal rubber. Oh, it smells funny as well. It smells funny as well, yeah. <laughs> With sniffers. It looks special. Okay. Special. Right, it's very next? squishy. Don't forget you've got that thing. Well, what have we got to do next? <gasps> oh. All right. Next is... Black liner. A Molotov Black Liner 0 0.4. This is a precise nib guarantees finer exact line work in your art. Easy to use. Ideal for sketching, outlining, detailing. A great addition to your fine line collection. It uses water-based archival ink and is resistant to water and chemicals, so it's an ideal pen for multi multimedia projects. It also features a new cap-off function that protects the pen from drying out for up to 180 minutes. Oh, also it says this the sweet in this month's box is not suitable for vegans or vegetarians. Okay, sorry. The last thing, well, not the last, the last thing, thing, but one the best thing. thing in it. We have one more thing. Oh, okay. This one. Excuse me. Right, this is Spectrum Noir Tri Blend Markers. Woohoo! Spectrum Noir Tri Blend Markers have a unique three in one design and blending system. These alcohol markers are equipped with three different colour shades that can be seemingly seamlessly blended for the perfect gradient finish. 
The pen has three separate ink chambers, each with a different colour, which can be transferred through a fine bullet nib, which helps produce the control blend. The three colours inside each section have been carefully developed to produce an effortless grade, yeah, grade, grade what? Gradium? Gradation. Gradation? Gradation, yeah. Which will deliver the same results every time with no trial and error or guesswork. These markers use high quality alcohol dye based ink that is designed to give a flawless, smooth, seamless coverage. These are $3.49 each. So they're like Copics. Mm. Never heard of them before, yeah. Bit Oh, they're cool. They're quite cool that they got a thingy on them. So what colours have we got? We've got a blue. I don't know if you can see the blue. It's not focusing, but blue. What else have you got? Oh, this says gold brown blend. Oh, yeah, blue. Yeah. So on each side, there's a different colour. You've got a light blue and a dark blue. And then this says antique pink blend. And then here it says light, medium, and dark. Obviously, not bloody showing up, is it? <laughs> so, yeah, you got. That's the dark. And then that's the medium. And then that's light. What oh, clever, isn't it? Three in one. So we've got blue, pink, and skin colour. Oh, gold, brown. Gold, brown. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice. Yep, there you go. So there's the last thing right. I have. The last thing is Claire Fontaine Gold Line A5 Layout Pad. High quality pad has 20 sheets of smooth surface texture paper to enable you to produce. To produce oh, oh, the front covers fell off. The front covers fell, fell off. As soon as I opened it. Produce your front best work. Off. The 70 GSM white paper eliminates spread, stops ink bleed, and allows the ink to dry quickly to avoid smudges and smears. It's That's really two, smooth. £2.20. Shall I test everything out on the page? You that's... want to, yep. Yeah. Uh, so on here it says the scrawler challenge is Imaginarium, which obviously Mani has never done a scrawler challenge the whole time she's got the box uh, it says each box provides you a selection of art supplies and inspiration but we also want to spark your creativity every month we'll give you a word or challenge try and create something using just the supplies in your box and share it at hashtag scroll challenge so we've got so yeah 349 each for the pens 198 for the marker i don't think i said that before the pencil was 120 the eraser was one at fifty five, and the pad was two pound twenty. Excuse me, in a minute, I might even show you what she's got. I do like this. It's got a skeleton with the eye with a wing on it, like a sausage man. It looks like a sausage. I want to try out the rubber to see what they mean. Oh, these must be the same colours that you've got, Miney. Look, gold, blue, pink. Yeah, these are the colours. Yeah, so these are the colours of the markers. Right, I'm going to try out this rubber. Whoa. Yeah, there's nothing, just little little bits and they stick together. That is helpful. Mm. I like this one. Right. She's just trying out the pens. Well, she's trying the fine line next. This does look good. Oh, look, it's like little Grim Reapers. Octopuses. A few bottles of beer. An acorn on the lamp, on the lighthouse. Anyway, while Molly's doing that, we hope everyone is staying safe and is not poorly with the coronavirus. And we send our best wishes to everybody. We hope everyone is alright. And if we just do as we're told and stay indoors, hopefully it will all be over by the time summer comes and we can enjoy the nice weather. Yes. And Molly can see her friends again. That was good, mate. So it's kind of like Copics. And also, while we're on the point of coronavirus, we're thinking of all these year 11s and year 6s that couldn't do any of their prom or lever stuff this year. Mm -hmm. Or exams, it's very sad. What about the year 12s? All the year 12s, all the people that couldn't do any exams or have any kind of levers. Isn't, it's just not nice. I'm just I'll pause you. I'll pause you and we'll come back in a minute. Okay, we're back. She's done it. She tried them all out. But the last, the last one, she started at the dark, at the dark end instead of the light end, and now she's all confused. Here we are. Yeah. 
face. These are the colours. Mine's going to show this you. This is everything. And I tested out the rubber. I did a big scribble there. And it's gone. So the rubber's very good. I love it. I love the rubber. And then the big fine liner. Well, not big, but fine liner. Yeah. yeah, fine liners there. Pencil. Pencil. And these are the shades in the pen. Blue. Brown. Pink. And they're very smooth paper. Look at the paper. It's just... Very smooth. You get the point. Very smooth. And we're back. Okay. Can you get your thing out and we'll add it what we got? Mm -hmm. Let's see. Well, that's one because it doesn't normally go through, does it? The other ones didn't go through. Phone's there. Oh, hello. Oh, it's on she's on charge. So we're a bit, we're a bit tangled. Right. <coughs> Calculate down. Okay, so it's three forty nine each for the pens, and you've got three of those. Three forty nine is quite good for those pens, isn't it? Is that for one of the pens? Yeah. The fine liner is one ninety eight. The pencil is one twenty. The rubber is one fifty five, and the pad is two pounds and twenty p. This box is fifteen pounds, including the postage. Yeah. Oh, ah, oh, bloody! I just poked myself in the eye. <laughs> just poked myself in the eye. Okay. Everything in the box all together equals. Seventeen pounds and forty p. Oh, we only really just made it, didn't we? We only really just made it. I know, but but we got some good stuff. And the thing as well, what we find is we find stuff like in here that you get. Which you would never actually no, exactly like look at. Like, but where find would you it? even find these? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, so that's that's a good thing. You try, you get to try things that you wouldn't normally get. And obviously, these are a lot cheaper than Copic markers, aren't they? Mhm. Mm they three pound fifty each. Yeah, and they're quite good. Oh, actually, they're. Probably about the same price. Are they? Well, oh yeah, like maybe. A third. Maybe. You know, because you it might be like two price. thirds of the price worth. But Copics are just one marker. Yeah, where'd you get three in here? Yeah. yeah. So yeah, okay. So that's everything. That's everything we've got today. We hope you enjoyed this video. Yes. Hopefully there'll be more as long as the postman keeps bringing the parcels. But obviously, if you can't bring them due to coronavirus, we're not going to hold it against you, aren't we? <laughs> just throw my phone on that. Blah. We want everyone to. We want everyone to be safe and healthy. We don't want to lose, don't want to lose any lives, do we? Cool. So yes. So we hope you're all very safe. Keep them very well. Please give this video a little like and a comment. And that's now you're getting on. And we'll hopefully see you soon. Take care, everyone. Au